Students who attend these conferences are taking the role as Dr. King today, and they will share their knowledge with you all. So we ask you all to be open-minded, ready to learn, respect each other, and speak. Speak because your, your perspective is unique. Speak because you have a passion for something. Speak because you are important to our community and our growth as an inclusive, as an inclusive community. So good morning, everyone. Welcome to Speak Ravenscroft 2014. On MLK Day, upper school students from all grade levels led student workshops that were all focused on diversity and inclusion. These workshops enabled students to lead not only themselves, but others. To finish off the day, sacrificial poets came in and shared some poetry with us. Poetry, first and foremost, is a medium to tell your story, right? The idea that if you don't tell your story, somebody else will. And when people tell our stories for us, they tend to get it messed up, mixed up, distorted. Um, you know, put in what they want. So it's very important that whatever you do in life, not necessarily just through spoken word, that you tell your story. In your romantic relationship, in your family relationships, getting a job, going to college, you need to know who you are and be able to convey that powerfully to the world. And that's what spoken word has been for us. The days, like 10 hour heat waves on the horizon and the nights were as quick and as fleeting as a mirage and we pass time on our breaks by playing Yu-Gi-Oh. My brother asked what my favorite card is and I tell him it's the basic monster card because it forms a backbone and it does all the real work, right? And yeah. My brother and my father admire these cards too, but my father, my father sees something different here. My father admires their sacrifice. I wear red shoes to remind myself of where I came from. Years of northern oppression, trail of tears, bloody footprints, red shoes walked through this land long before I did. They remind me that even though there isn't blood on my hands, it lives in my roots. My fingers can sometimes part in a bus seat for Rosa Pool, that even by sitting down, women can take a stand. Sometimes through suffering or suffrage, and I like to think the true female MCs, artists, musicians, have learned from Harriet Tubman, so they keep their tracks underground, making music and poetry to bring their people to the promised land. I find truth, I find power in my mama's hand, pushing a broom for 17 years, and though I'm grown and consider myself a man on my own, I raise my hands and swear allegiance to my ex chromosome Overall, Speak was a wonderful day. Keeping in line with the spirit of MLK, Speak was a day of student leadership, raising awareness about diversity and inclusion, and empowering students to speak up for what's right.